Hey, you tourists. It's your boy, Domination. This is back in the basic show. The deuces I would do. Text, baby. My man does back. You know what is. All the place, 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 go get it. All the place, go get it. All the place, all the place, all the place, go get it. All the place, go get it. All the place, go get it. It's right back at basic. Shout out to Deuce and Sabadu. Text, baby. None of those back. You know what it is. You know what it is. Real men rise up. Fake men rise down. Real women rise up. Fake women rise down. Right to where I preach and preach on. And today's today's topic we're going to talk about is... Harvey, I just saw your video, man. I know exactly how you feel sometimes. I feel the same way, but it, it, ain't, it ain't worth for me getting remorse and getting angry. I understand that. Pain is more important to everyone, included to every pain that feel, I felt any pain that anybody felt. But my, my issue is I don't like the fake outrage. You know, you know what's so funny? Like when you said about George Zimmerman got arrested again, I'm not. I I don't even give a fuck about George Zimmerman at this point because George Zimmerman is the new face of O.J. Simpson. He's the new J of of, of Fast and Speedy and God of uh, Mexican O.J. Simpson. I could tell the tension between the the blacks and the Mexicans, but a lot of that I'm blaming black, black gorilla family and the Mexican mafia. They 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 allow that to go on. But yeah, both of them are hypocrites. That's say fuck both of them because it, it just showed me they even do more harm to their own people than they do their other people. That that showed me a lot. And Aryan Brotherhood, they have no succession. They really don't. But you know what? We live in a world. I, I swear, it's like a damn circus sometimes. I'm I'm part of the damn circus act, and they go continue to put it on. This is why they look at America as that we're, we're the stupid ones because we believe anything what tells us. I don't believe anything what the media tells me. And I know it's full of lies and full of accusation anyway. Let, let, okay. Harvey, let's just say that there's something odd about that Trayvon, I mean that Tra, that, that Trayvon Martin case. Hear me out when I say this. What if, if just a two words, but what if this case is all stage front. Me, it's, it's all hosted to try to make it look like a goddamn race war. And I'm not surprised if they could push that agenda. Because the reason why I say that, man, if you could look it up where the media came from, media came from the Persian Empire, the needs. That's why media is so powerful, too, and we use it powerful to let the tools in. It's full of shit. We, we, people need to start doing like that black woman doing. She said, fuck it, I quit. I wish it were more people liked her but it, it, and more people like that, period. But it would never be because they put all these false allegations, these false allies, these false stories. They will never tell the truth. I just want the truth. I don't care if it's racist act or not. Just give me the fucking truth. But but there's some people don't want to tell the goddamn truth. There's some people want to live this allegation, live this speculation of lies. I can't stand people who are ignorant. I ain't got time for them. It ain't worth going to jail behind going killing somebody. But I ain't gonna lie. If if, if I was if I was trade by Martin's father, I would have shot him by now. <laughs> I've been in jail. I've been in jail right now. If that was my son. But it, it, but I would say to this, in our community, we need to fix our community because right now we got to look at some of our mistakes to what we do. We got to look at ourselves sometimes and other people need to do the same too, including Caucasian, white folk. But like I said, man, you know, they always put us a pit against one another. I hate when they do that. That's another thing they need to stop doing. They always put a pit between the white man and the black man and the black woman and the white woman. Fuck all that. Whites and blacks got to work together. But but frankly, whites got their own problems they got to fix. The stuff that goes on in their community. Come on. And don't believe they stick together like that. They only stick a, 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 a cordially, but not necessarily all the time. And that's like any other race. Latino, Asian, Middle East, all that stuff. You know, I always wonder sometimes. 
I mean, look at up President Obama. They even think he's the worst president, and maybe he is. I hate to say this. I hate to say this. When, when, when Obama got in office, where did the so-called change that people say it is? I don't see no change one bit. But people, if you want some real change, make some real change for yourself. This is why I never vote politics. I don't care if they're Democrat or Republican. If you're going to say you're going to do something, just do it. Don't sit there and just talk. Oh, we're going to do it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. I don't care what race you are or what sexual preference you is, gay or straight, or if you're a Christian, if you're a Muslim. I don't care what you do. If you say you're going to do something, just do it. Or then sit down and shut the hell up. You're basically just talking. And that goes to rich, that goes to poor, that goes to middle. Middle class work. I mean, you know, I can feel that outrage. But the reason why I show Michael Brown, there's something odd about that incident. Did you know they got a video coming out and posting on YouTube? They had the same name, Michael Brown. Same name. But there's something host of, of host, hosted hosts onto that. And, and you know that's not, that people that ain't really living in St. Louis, that was outskirt, outside of St. Louis. And people, if you, if you hear some people are talking, they say they're not really from there. So, so they don't tell them what's going on. I'm not even there. But my point is this. They better understand. They better look what's, what's, what's been mistaken and, and, and know what the hell what is going on. Because right now in 2015, I think it's going to get worse. Because they're going to they, they're gonna be more than worried about these damn problems. Over there in France. I want to feel pain for France. But part of that, we're that same pain with us when we're dying. It's the same thing on 9-11. People ain't learned from 9-11. Even if it's an inside job or not. And I need to talk about that damn interview movie between uh, 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 James uh, 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 James uh, Franco and, 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 and John uh, Roosevelt, whatever his name is. It's a good movie, the interview, but it's green light to assassinate a uh, uh, evil, I mean, an uh, evil dictator over there in North Korea. Look at Dennis Rodman. Dennis Rodman went over there. And he, and he ain't never been saw since. If people got mad at Dennis Robert, he chose sides to go to North Korea. See, you see what I'm talking about? It will never be peace between the United States and the rest of the world. And Russia and North Korea. I doubt it if it ever going to happen. I just doubt it. Because all they're doing is destroying their own country. That's all America going to do. And that's all North Korea going to do. And that's all Russia going to do. It will never be peace. But I guarantee you when it's going to mess up their damn families... We're going to see what, what, what real peace really is about. It's going to be more innocent people are dying. More people are dying. And the people who are not innocent, they need to get at the ones who who, who, who the ones who put in this play and this stuff in the first place. I, I get to a point, I got to worry about myself. I, I can't even look at the news anymore. I just can't because you don't know if the news telling the truth or not. You don't know. My father look at the news all the time. See, that's why people got to be careful where they get all this information from and get the insides of it instead of the outside. Because a lot of times you don't know if they're telling the truth or not. You don't know. Now, now don't get me wrong. Pain is more important to towards to others than towards other people. Nobody deserves to die. Not black, not white, not Asian, not Latino, not gay or straight, not men or women, not young and old. Nobody deserved to die unless God decided they, if they decided to go. But people, but but you never know when your time has come because I want to live forever. I ain't think about no damn death. I never did like funerals because people died all the time. People died at war. People died in, in the streets. You got the police trying to protect the people. Now don't get me wrong. There are good cops out here. But it's, it's these bad cops that's out here who ain't do no earthly good, giving bad police a bad name, you know. And then shout out to the troops that fight to our country to protect this whole United States. But it's out there the same way. I wish it would be the peace between the black and the white. 
because all it's doing is going backward instead of going forward. We got to go forward to this. I don't want to. I don't want to feel. I don't want to feel no 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 wish no death on no one. I don't want to wish no death on nobody. I make peace with my enemies, but the question is, have my enemies my enemies make peace for me? Because they, they hate that anybody see anybody happen. But I'm gonna tell you what's really sad, what's really a mistake, man. We 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 live we live we live in a country who are just selfish and and and, and, and downright evil, just evil men. Just don't give a damn about nobody. Don't respect about life. Who don't value a life and don't life for value to nothing. So Harvey, man, I I understand where you're coming from because I I feel the same way sometimes. But there's always remain hope. There's hope. Don't ever give up hope yet. Things will get a lot more come. I understand it. I felt like that. I, I I get that urge every time I go outside. But see, that's what they want you to do. They want you to get mad. They want you to get angry. They want you to go out there and hurt somebody for no reason. Because all it's going to do is going to create more bloodshed to shed all the, all, all the people who don't need to be shed in their lives. What stops from there? It's going to create more pains. And as long as it's going to create more pain, it's going to create more hatred. It's going to create more envy and create more enemies. The only way you got to understand that hatred, understand that hatred and understand that what what will come from. It comes from betrayal. It comes from distrust, disloyal. It's come from that. That's why people become villains because villain is another word people have been vilified. They vilify other people and demonize everyone. Then you got heroes. Heroes got to be main to be honored and honor what they may be honored, what they done for the people and done for the community, done for the side and play a better role and better role models. So I understand how you feel, man. But sometimes heroes got to be the one being saved because they can't save everybody. They sometimes they got to be the one save people because they've done more than enough. And sometimes they got to take out what's what's left within what's left the place to offer evil in this world. All, all villains going to do is going to vilify people want to destroy the world and want to conquer the world, want to overthrow everything and want to make their own form of government and, and make it and, and instead of using former government has already been used already. So I understand where you come from and I understand that rage and that anger, you know, and people got to understand why they did it, why they do these things. I think deep down some of them are being hurting inside. But people better understand between good and evil. They need to understand it. But it's not what you, it's not what you are, it's what you choose or what you choose to be. Only thing it's got to produce and resolve that hatred and 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 and, and, and confront that hatred. If we cannot confront that hatred, and we got to do it with overcome with love. If we're gonna overcome with bear with hate, it's not gonna be barreled out of that hate. It ain't gonna never gonna heal. Because they're going to create more people like George Zimmerman. They're going to create more people like um, uh, Lucky Luciano. They're going to create more people like Hitler. They're going to create more people like so many people out there create more pain. As long as we have this system. And that's the problem. Same thing, racism. I can't stand racism. I can't stand it. I don't care who's the first or not. But it ever wonders to you that we're stepping in our own land. And that's the sad part. If that's if they're American, I'm American, too. I, I'm born here. I grew up out here all my life. You know, without here, ain't no telling where I want to go. So understand that it's got to be a lot more better and better will come. And certainly, certainly um, yet better to come. So. Harvey, I understand what you're saying. I understand where you come from. But understand this. Hope will be on the way shortly, real soon, more to come. Because it's, it's going to be better things, place better for us and better for everybody in society. Because we, we got to do better as a people. Because we got to. Because it's too much hate in the world. Too much resentment. Too much anger. I can't stand it. I want to see people laugh, cry, joy. You know, I want to see all that. Because all it's going to do is going to create more pains. That's all it's going to create. 
So I understand where that comes from. Believe me, I felt like that at times. You felt like you want to give up and say, forget it. You know, you 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 just want to go out there and and and, and dress it off to kill someone. I, I understand. I felt like that at times. But something tells me that's what they want. They want you to create more vision, and all you're gonna create the pe pe feel in people's pain when you're taking someone else's people's lives. But they need to start thinking about this too, because once they create more more allies, they're gonna create more pains and resent everybody's and the families they hurt and they lost. So what I'm saying is, a people, man. We got to do better so we can, the better we got. Because right now, we're losing ourselves. Nothing presents, nothing presents itself or presents and resists them in a war. But it's got to bring beyond peace. And peace going to be on, of over war. Because all war is going to do is cause confusion and cause of, 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 of annihilation and nephilation. So love will be coming away shortly. All hate is going to do is going to remain destroy the love. Love will will overcome to kill off the hate. So that's all I gotta say. Better yet, it's gonna be what we are as a be as a folks, and, and what we are as a come. So Harvey, God bless, man. Keep doing what you're doing, and that's all I can say about that. And keep the Lord of faith, trust, and God in anything, man. You go, you gonna get through this, man. You you gonna get through this because I know I know how I felt what it's like. But it, it, things will get better. You just have to make your life better. And when it get through. All right. All right. It's your boy Domination. This is back of the base of Jungle Deuces. I would do this. How we do this. How we do it. It's your boy Domination. This is the back of the base. How we do it. How we do it. Back of the base. Back of the base in Texas, baby. Until next time. All right. All right. Peace and I'm out.